Well, the family, of course, is completely devastated. They tell us the woman is just 18 years old and she was here visiting her girlfriend who lived in the home. I don't know what you want to call that. I don't know what leads to some that kind of madness. A family struggling to understand what could have happened inside this Windsor Locks home overnight as their sister, 18 year old Lauren Layla Leslie was shot and killed. They tell us she was visiting the home to see her girlfriend who lives here. I mean, she was beautiful, talkative, very calm, soft spoken and you know, you can't find people like her often. Like she's very delicate, very soft. You know, she's she was herself. Herself. Police were called to the Lowndes Drive home around 1 this morning. They say neighbors heard yelling and screaming. What they found, unfortunately, was three adults suffering from gunshot wounds and all had no signs of life. A fourth adult was rushed to the hospital with multiple gunshot wounds and a fifth person wasn't harmed. Police say two of the adults are a couple. They're investigating this as a domestic murder suicide. They believe the suspect is among those dead. The victim's brothers feel the relationship between their sister and her girlfriend may have played a role into what happened here. She's a proud black lesbian woman. And I feel like it's not fair that she had to go through this. So it's very difficult for me to know that now her being her true self and living in her, her reality, this is the result of that in my eyes. And police aren't saying anything about a motive just yet. As you can see, this is still an active scene here. We're told police are expected to be here through 7 o'clock tonight. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom from Windsor Locks. Courtney's other Channel 3 Eyewitness News.